Good afternoon, friends. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you what I got my four-year-old daughter and my 40-year-old husband for Christmas. For the sake of time, I am going to turn the camera around and show the items laid out on the table. I'll start with my daughter. This is what I got my four-year-old daughter for Christmas. She's upstairs, so I need to do this quickly. We went to Disney World this year and she loved it. She loves Minnie Mouse. She always has loved Minnie Mouse. I got her a dress from Walmart that is like this with the sweater on top and the floofy skirt on the bottom that's Cinderella. And she wore it there and she loved it. She was so cute. So I got her one from Walmart that's Minnie Mouse this time. And she loves wearing princess nightgowns. She has a frozen one and I don't remember what the other one is, but she doesn't have the Cinderella one. So I got her the Cinderella one. She met Cinderella at Disney World and she was so blown away. So she's going to love this. I got these at Kohl's on Claire's. I'm sure that I got 50% off that price. I bought the next size up for her last year or maybe it was this summer or earlier in the year. And these are so cute. She will love those boots. One thing she asked for was a panda bear with babies. So I got this on Amazon. It's a panda bear and you unzip her and she has babies inside. Now, my daughter got the puppy dog surprise one last year and loved it. So that's why she wanted the panda one and she wanted the unicorn one. So they each come with three babies inside and you can zip it up and put them back in or take them out. She just, that's one of her favorite things. So I also got her, her big present is going to be a dress up um, wardrobe. My husband has to put it together. It's downstairs. So I'll just pop a picture of that up. But I got her these dresses to go along with it. She does not have the snow white dress up dress. So I got that. And I'm going to just put that on the wardrobe so that she'll see it. It'll be her, like her S-A-N-T present. And then this is just like a fairy. And it comes with these butterflies and safety pin onto the dress. It's pretty floofy. Now the it toy this year that everybody's been talking about is this cookies bakery. And I know she would love it. She loves the magic mixies. So I know she's gonna love this. Um, it was $35 and I got it on Amazon. And I got it a while back because I was afraid it was gonna be like a Tickle Me Elmo situation. So I went ahead and got that a couple of months ago. This big Smarties I got at Five Below. I'm sure it has just packages of little Smarties inside, but I like having like the big one for the dramatic effect. <laughs> She's a girly girl and she loves purses. I thought this was so cute. I love novelty purses. It's an ice cream cone and it's the Claire's brand and I got it at Walmart and it was $17.88. I don't think it actually was that price. I feel like it was closer to $15. Maybe it was on sale. I also got her some more Play-Doh. She loves playing with Play-Doh and she loves puppy dogs. So I thought that was a good kit for her. I think this was only $5 or so. And she's very into science right now. So I got her this crystal kit and I know that we will have to make it with her because it's not something obviously she can do on her own, but I think that she will love this because she likes watching um, Emily's, uh, I don't remember what it's called, but it's this science show on Netflix with this lady who does experiments. In addition to these presents and the wardrobe, I also found a uh, Gabby's Dollhouse on Facebook Marketplace for $25 with all the characters and some accessories. And so she'll be getting that as well. And she's been asking for that for a little while, but I really didn't want to pay um, full price for that. So I will give that to her as well. Here's what I got my daughter for her Christmas stocking. I was actually proud of myself for not going overboard this year. So I'll start off with the candy. This candy I got at Meyer for after Halloween clearance. Um, I actually used some of this for her advent calendar already. I also got her some candy from Walmart. When we were shopping for our Angel Trini teens, she chose Starburst candy canes for them. So I feel like this is her preferred candy cane flavor. 
Of course, for Christmas, you have to get one of these plastic candy canes. So I got her Skittles and hers. I also got her this tube of mini M&Ms. She loves Oreo cookies. So I grabbed this little mini pack and also this baby bottle. This is one of her favorite type of candies. If you've never had it before, the top is a sucker and then there's powder inside. So it's kind of like fun dip. At five below, I found this cute mini hot dog gummy. And I think it was probably 50 cents or something like that, but I just thought it was so cute. She loves wearing fuzzy socks to bed and it's actually hard to find toddler size fuzzy socks, but I found these at Target. They were $3 per pack and there's two in each pack. So she'll be really happy with these. At Walmart, I also got her this watch. Frozen is her favorite princess movie right now, so I think she'll really like this. I also got her this frozen chapstick and this princess lip gloss at Walmart, and they were a dollar each in the stocking stuffer section. They also had these really cute kids face masks, and she loves doing face masks, so I grabbed her three of those. Walmart carries some items from Claire's now, and she is always in need of hair barrettes because those things get lost so quickly. So I grabbed these for her and they were $4.88. In the bin of $5 movies at Walmart, I found this Paw Patrol movie. I have a TV with a DVD slash VCR in my room and she really likes watching movies with me in bed at night. So I needed to add this to my collection because I really don't have a ton of children's movies. These stickers were after Easter clearance and she loves the Disney princesses. I also got this body wash pen in the stocking stuffer section at Walmart for a dollar. I got this bath confetti at Walgreens. It was a part of their after Christmas clearance and it was 80% off. So I don't know how much it was. It was probably extremely cheap. My daughter loves Yetis. So I picked this up at Kohl's. It's a toy where you add water and it grows to three times its size. So she'll have fun with that. At Walgreens, I got this Color Reveal Princess and she really loves the Color Reveal Barbies. So I think she'll like this as well. I don't remember how much this was, but I do know that I use Walgreens cash to pay. So this is everything that I'm putting in my daughter's Christmas stocking. I actually remember that I have some more Easter clearance in the basement, but I think I'm just going to leave that for Easter coming up and stick with all of these things because this is sufficient. This is what I got my husband for Christmas. He really needs a new pair of blue jeans. So I got him this pair of blue jeans from Gap. And I've also got him this black sweater from Macy's. It's a nice thin sweater. He can wear it over like a dress shirt. He has a sweater like this, but it is very faded and old. So I thought it was time for a new one. He's been wearing a lot of hats lately and he mentioned that he would like a retro one from a retro UK one. This is the college where we live and the basketball team is a big deal. So I think this is from the nineties. I got it on eBay. I think he'll like that. His slippers are in really bad shape. He wears them a lot because he works remotely from home. He's a software developer. So I got him these Cool Burra by Ugg slippers from Kohl's. And I think that he'll really like these. I got him the Ugg slippers. Um, I think, oh man, I think it was our first Valentine's Day together. And he wore them for years before they just got too gross. And then I got him a cheaper pair later on, but that pair has been destroyed as well. So he really needs a new one. And I think that he'll like this pair. They're very comfortable. Um, he collects vintage video games. Um, so he has a shelf with all of them. And I thought that these lights would look really good on that shelf. They're from Mario, the star, and then the mushroom. And I thought that would just look really cool there. And he'll appreciate that. He's been doing a lot of cooking lately and mentioned that he would like a hand blender. So I found this on Amazon. And I think he'll like this. He loves mountain biking and he's dropped his phone out of his pocket a couple times. So I thought that this would be a good gift for him. It 
attaches to the front of his bicycle and he can stick his phone in it and even play you know music and stuff if he wants to or put his keys in the little pocket as well he saw this at a store recently and didn't buy it and i knew he wanted it so i put it in the notes of my phone to remember to pick it up for him it's uh credence clear water revival we like to listen to records in our living room and just relax and maybe have a drink from time to time. So he'll like this. And I need to get this framed. My husband loves Stephen King. He reads all of his books. And The Shining is one of his favorite Stephen King movies or movies based on Stephen King's books. And if you've ever seen the movie, this is the picture at the end that they zoom in on and they see that Jack Nicholson's character is in this old picture. So I bought this on Etsy and they photoshopped me in there and then they photoshopped my husband in as well. So I think he'll think this is funny and I'm gonna go ahead and get it framed and give it to him framed. So that's everything that he's getting for Christmas. I think that he'll really enjoy these gifts. Some are practical and some are more just for fun, but I think he'll really like them. Here's everything that I'm putting in my husband's stocking. I got this at Walgreens. It's a six in one tool. And the really handy part is that it comes with the little screwdriver. And when you have little kids, the battery packs require tiny screwdrivers. So I actually already had to open it up and use it for one of my daughter's toys. So that will definitely come in handy. I don't remember where I got this, probably at Walmart on clearance. I got this at the Dollar Tree along with these snacks. And this is for cleaning your sneakers. So that's just a little handy tool. And then at Bath and Body Works, they did a sale. They do sales like every few days around Christmas. And it was $2.95 for soap, like all the bar soaps were $2.95. So I got this for him and this is a really good scent. And I also got this lotion for him. They were doing a sale um, where the lotions and I think body wash were $4.95. So I got this then. And I think that this was during semi-annual sale or I used my free reward for it. So this is rose, rosewood and smoke. Wow. Woodsy smell. I'm going to smell this. Okay. So you can't really smell the smoke in that one. And this one is cool citrus, fresh sage, and Virginia cedar. <laughs> That's specific. I really like this one. So hopefully he'll like those as well. He does like the Bath and Body Works soap. Um, he's been using the ocean scent, but I didn't find an ocean bar, but I really liked this scent. I got this chocolate frog at five below. Um, if you've seen Harry Potter, this is a thing in that movie and books. And then I got these Virginia Slim little tiny sticks. They were three for a dollar there. He collects retro video games. And so I got him this DuckTales one at the used bookstore. And then I got him this Hades video game for the Switch at the used game store. And I also got him this Nintendo Power magazine. He really likes Zelda. This isn't in great shape, but he used to get this magazine when he was a kid, so I know he'll like this. And I got him this Link Candies tin. Zelda is one of his favorite video games, so I just thought this was cute. I don't know if he'll even wanna eat the candies. <laughs> and then I got this at Meijer. It's the coasters for different video games, and I just thought it was cute and he would like that. This big pack of Mentos, it's 120 pieces and I got this at Walmart. I think it was $7. Uh, he will probably just eat it out of this bag. I don't think we even have <laughs> a Mentos container to refill. I got this candy at Meijer after Halloween on clearance for 75% off and I stuck it in my freezer so that it wouldn't get eaten. Um, he really likes Reese's. And then this is a mix of milk chocolate, peanut butter, and peanut. So those are all really good M&M flavors. And this is his favorite candy bar, Snickers peanut butter. Um, I had never had this until we started dating and this is a really good candy bar. So that's everything that I'm putting in his stocking. I think that he'll love all of it. Let me know what you're sticking in your husband's stocking if, if you have a husband. 
I hope that you enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll have a playlist in my description box below with other videos that I've made in past Christmases. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Check out my Instagram and TikTok. They are both at Amy Way to Save.